This thing is heavy. Oh, this heavy. thing is actually heavy. Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Mm. Uh huh. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome to Wademaya's channel. Thank you so much for clicking. If you're new to this channel, please subscribe, follow him. You know, um, share this video, give it a thumbs up, people comment, let us know what you think. So guess what? You guys already know I am in Ghana and I am in his house, in his father's house, should I say. And finally, finally, we are going to know how they make food here. Because Wademaya has been singing all the time. Oh, you want me to die? You want me to die? I need to eat good food. I need to eat fufu. I need to go back home. Yeah. I had enough of that. So we are here to see if this fufu is actually worth it. Is it worth it? Let's see how it's made from beginning to end. And then we are going to eat it and see if it's tasty. If it's worth it. So yeah. Here we go. So this is cassava. Yeah, this is cassava. And then you see. Come believe I'm learning how to make it. Guys, I'm not going to put it my mind. I'm not going to See, so in, in Uganda, they call this word banana. banana, but in Ghana, we call it plantain. Plantain? Yeah, this is plantain. Okay. And it's so big. So big, yeah. Oh, it is very big. Yeah, very big. I've never seen such a big banana. It's, it's not banana. Africa. You've seen they're not this big in East Africa. It's somehow like this, but they still wow. call it banana, but we call it plantain in here. In Kenya, we don't have such big bananas. Okay. This is not banana, this is called plantain. Now, they have to wash. They have to wash it. No, you know, she's washing the plantain. You see? So now we're done. We're gonna put it on fire. Okay. We're ready. Minutes? For how many minutes? Yeah. I don't know. Maybe how many minutes? Mm -hmm. Huh? And him that then. Gas cooker. Oh, what video am I? Okay. Okay, you mean? What do you mean? Yeah. She's not cutting it into small pieces? No. This is very interesting. In Kenya, we don't do this. First of all, in Kenya, we never boil onions. We always fry, put them on, you know, hot oil and stuff. And then we cut them into very small pieces. So this is really new, interesting. This is the onion. Yeah, the good was to me. Oh, they are the vegetables. Yeah, it's done. Nice. Yes. So you, you're not gonna cut the onions. They're just gonna. No, 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 no. Just gonna blend the, everything together. Oh, okay. Yeah, they're gonna blend it together. That's interesting. And you know, I was told that um, healthy food looks colorful. So if you eat food that's one color, like just white. Yeah. So that which means ugali is not healthy. Even for food, then it's not healthy. <laughs> So here we see there's green, there's red, there's yellow, there's it purple, purple as well. Yeah. So this food is definitely healthy. But uh, after blending it, they're not going to throw the water away. Oh, really? Why? So you see, that is what they need paint is. Uh, if you throw the water away, all the nipples are Wow. You have the onion, you have all the kakari and the tomatoes. Yeah. So all the nutrients are coming to the water. Yeah. So you use it for the soup. You pour it in the soup. It's very interesting information. Wow. That's really interesting. What a wow. So the color of the meat has changed. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it looks and smell, it actually smells so good. Yeah. Can feel the spices. Yeah, you know. exactly. So So had you put water before? Yes. Or was it just spices? You just water. water. Yeah. Just water. So why are you adding water? For more soup? For more soup, exactly. Oh, nice. Okay. Wow. Just wow. Mm -hmm. okay. Finally, yeah. we're adding what you blended. Yeah. yeah. Mm. So we have to wait maybe 20 minutes. 20 minutes. Have I seen them frying anything? I've just seen them no, boiling. No, They're everything actually not fried. Fried right? nothing. Anything. Is healthy food. Everything is boiled, no oil. Nice. Good. 
That's all. This is awesome, man. Yeah. I hadn't noticed that up to this point. Oh. Cool. So he'll be eating it. So this is how the rough food is made, you know? Wow. See. Oh my god, what if she hits her? <laughs> hey, she's she's definitely not good. What the hell? Oh, she are used to it. Are you used to it? Yes. Wow, oh, come on. We mm -hmm. have used the cassava to clean the water. Mm -hmm. After oh. that, we put in the plantain. So you finish pounding the plantain before you pound the cassava. Ah. After you have finished the two, we add the two together. Why can't you, you do them can't. together? Why can't you mash them together? No, it's good. Why? You add, after you have finished pounding the cassava, you put it aside and pound the cassava. After you have finished pounding the cassava, you put it aside and pound the cassava. After that, you add the two together so that it will be mixed. And then it's the spoons for eating. I feel like oh. it's a lot of work. It's a lot of work. Cassava. No, doing this, pounding. So you take it's a, a energy. Yeah. Yeah. And this mm. exercise. Oh yeah. It's part of exercise. Nice. Mm. Mm. At times some people use a machine uh -huh. for blending it. But if you wanted to do an exercise, you pan it yourself. With your strength. <laughs> yeah. This is actually the lesson. If you don't wanna go to the gym. This one as a is gonna try it out for the first time. Okay, let's do this. Okay. 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 Just lifting and putting it down, right? Hey, it shouldn't be that hard. This thing is heavy. Oh, this thing heavy. is actually heavy. Yeah, are you sure? Uh huh. I'm afraid of hurting her, you know. No. no. <laughs> <laughs> Add more pressure. Oh my god, my hands are huh? <laughs> <laughs> Where, where is he now? This is the fufu. Finally. Finally. This is the final product. So you're gonna eat fufu for the first time? I can't wait. Are you ready? I'm so ready. Huh? Are you ready? I'm so ready. Okay, so. Preparing? Yes. yes. Fufu and life soup. Ah. Goat meat. Goat meat. Uh. Wow. That looks good. Just wow. Yo, what up everybody? It's your boy Mr. Ghana, baby, once again. We are done with the preparation of the fufu. It's time to eat. And I'm gonna eat this fufu with me, Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm ready. It's your first time to try fufu. Are you ready for it? So ready. So ready. How ready? I'm ready, ready. Hello. You know, we've been talking about fufu all the time. Oh, we need to eat fufu. We need to go back to Ghana. So let's see if it's worth it. Let's see if it's worth it. So. First of all, you need to wash your hands. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so we're done with washing our hands. Time to eat. This is cocoa. And then this is what? Is it? You can try the bread first. Try the bread first. No, you don't eat with two hands. It has two hands. They say this. So a bit disrespectful. Are you serious? Okay, so... No? 
Ghanaians will be very angry if yeah. they see you chewing food. Okay. You can chew the meat just like that. It's different, something different, pretty good. Something different, very really good. Mm -hmm. This is my favorite. Oh, really? <coughs> I've been telling you all yeah. the time that I need food, so I want to eat food. So, this is actually my favorite. So, this is the, the goat you've ever the chicken? No, no. Goat is actually my one of my favorite. But most of the time I like the kakko. Kakko is what? The Medo? salted fish. Oh, fish. The salted fish, yeah. Okay. That's kakko. I was so scared, like, Miss Trudy is not going to like this food because she tried kenke, she said I don't like it. And you don't just kenke? Kenke, bangkun, she didn't like it. I didn't love kenke because it was like, it tasted like ugali that has spices. Can you imagine East Africa? Can you imagine eating ugali with roiko salt? I don't know. You know, it was awkward. You know, but this. This is really good. I'm just happy. She's in love with my favorite food. So just get ready to know how to prepare it because this is what I love most. Mm -hmm. Next time when I come to Kenya, I will just do. Yeah, we look at all these things in Kenya. Plantain. <laughs> you look for it. You go to Uganda. Before today, I actually told. They are using bananas for this. Apparently, it's plantain. Yeah. There's a difference between plantain and banana, and they exactly look alike. So. Yeah. So it's your boy, Mr. Ghana, baby. Thank you so much for watching. And this is gonna be my last video in Ghana. No. And I'll be heading back to China tomorrow morning. So this is how it is. Thank you so much for supporting the Africa to the World movement. I'll be back in May. And we are gonna project the real Africa. I mean, the beautiful Africa to the world. Don't forget to support the Patreon page. Don't forget to support the GoFundMe page. Help us buy equipment because it's not easy. Help us pay our flight tickets because it's really expensive to travel within Africa. Especially, you want to say something before I go? Mm. Thank you so much for watching. Show us some love, give a thumbs up, give a comment, and yeah, uh, keep supporting him. He's doing an amazing job. So. It's all about Africa to the world. It's your boy, Mr. Ghana, baby. And I'm gonna see you in the next one. Aya Maya. Aya Maya. Hold on. Peace out. Aya Maya.